You're watching From the Heart with John Willard. Hi friends, John Willard here. A great show today about thoughtfulness and caring. And remember the subscribe button below for CNA TV. It's cold in the Ozarks, but the hot apple cider tantalizes the senses. As sunrise breaks into daylight, I smile. One more sip of apple cider and my day will begin. I'm glad to have had these moments. I'm thankful for the peace of this morning. The spacious roadside park adjacent to an interstate highway contained attractive picnic areas, convenient drinking fountains, and clean restroom facilities. The Texas Highway Department obviously had thought of everything, including appropriate accommodations for travel-weary pets to the bright red fire plugs. Mm. Thoughtfulness comes in many forms, and it is virtually always welcomed by its recipients. Thoughtfulness is a habit, a way of life well worth cultivating and practicing. The thoughtful person is quick to pay a well-deserved compliment or to send a prompt note of congratulations to someone who has received a promotion, an honor, or special recognition. Thoughtful people park a bit farther from the entrance of the store or the post office, leaving the nearer space for someone who doesn't get around as easily as they once did. The thoughtful person takes photographs of his neighbor's homes after a beautiful snowfall and later surprises those friends with the cherished snapshots. Thoughtful people don't wait for opportunities they imaginatively create numerous opportunities to make life brighter, smoother, and more enjoyable for all those about them. Our thoughtful attitude and generous deeds can make many people very happy, including ourselves. To those who are weary, fretted, and worried, there is no physician like nature. When our nerves are frazzled and our sleep is unrefreshing, we can find no better antidote to the glamorous grind and frenzy of the city than in the stillness and solitude of hills, streams, and tranquil stars. That man lays up for himself resources of strength, who now and then exchanges the ledger for green leaves, the factory for wildflowers, the business for brook croon and bird song. Mm. Let me share this poem. The little cares that fretted me, I lost them yesterday. Among the fields above the sea, among the winds at play, among the lowing of the herds, the rustling of the trees, among the singing of the birds, the humming 
of the bees. The foolish fears of what may happen, I cast them all away. Among the clover-scented grass, among the new-mown hay, among the husking of the corn, where drowsy poppies nod, where all the thoughts die and good are born, out in the fields with God. Hmm. My final thought. To those wearied, be thoughtful and caring. There is no physician like nature. Well, friends, it's time for me to feed the pups. So I gotta go. But you can reach me on Twitter at John Willard 47 Until next week, friends, this is John Willard from the farm.